Hey guys, welcome back to another beautiful day in the land of Boxer. <laughs> and I just um, and, um, noticed that I forgot to tell you something in, in the last episode. Um, at least not to tell you, but something that I didn't show you. Uh, mm. Which is this condenser room that I started together with you guys and I completely changed it. Um, I made a bunch of condensers, I, well I just condensed them. Um, and retrievers which I still had. Um, and I just made it like this, which is a lot more um, efficient in space. So all these receivers, only two are working, so those are the two before. So that's, um, one is redstone, the other one is basalt, which, uh, oh, I didn't do that in the episode, so I made that as well. Um, yeah, so that's all working. And I made the other ones as well, so all I have to do is put a timer there and then, um, put the receiver on, on the right number. Um, and that goes into the main sorting facility. So now if we need iron, for example, we'll just put some iron in there, done. Um, yeah, uh, so that's pretty much it. Um, it's pretty handy, this uh, already s set up like this, and I've, I figured it would be easier if I just set it all up now instead of having to do it one by one by one uh, whenever I need it. Uh, so that is the condensers. Uh, I also made the power room, which uh, is empty, but I sort of, um, oh, I didn't fulfill it completely. Um, it's kind of interesting, by the way, I can show you now. Is that, is it? You gotta be kidding me. It's raining again. <laughs> uh, this goes into my old real craft factory. <laughs> uh, so I'll have to sort of block this off. Um, yeah, so that's it here. But for today, we're going to get out of here. Um, we're going to try and take a snooze, although it's day, so we can't. Uh, this rain is killing me, like seriously. Oh, also, you guys asked me uh, what the doors were for. Let me show you. Noise. I'm not sure how much it lags on this new server. Uh, oh, it lags a lot. Well, there we go. Oh, it's not working anymore. I must have broken it. Actually, I remember I broke it. Um, but anyways, these are doors, so they slide open. Like that. Uh, and that part as well, normally. Um, but I broke something because I needed something from the control room. Yeah, these cables and stuff. Uh, hmm. I'll just disconnect it completely. It's probably better. There we go. Yeah. Might be a bit weird now, but... Come on. Yeah, that's better. So these are massive frame doors. They open. And eventually they'll go down into... I don't know what I'm going to make there. Uh, probably a rocket, like I was saying. A missile. But I'm not sure yet. I might have other plans for it. Radio, let's get out of the rain, although, well, <laughs> uh, right, let's get rid of my stuff, now I did em empty my inventory a bit for you guys, um, oh, is it dark yet, oh it is, what the, oh, that's fast, let's hope, let's hope, that the rain stops, yes, very good, Alright, so I did a little bit of preparation already. Uh, we're going to make nuclear reactors today. Uh, and I also made 60 MFSUs. Yes, 60. Because this thing is going to create a ton of power. <laughs> so, yeah, we'll need that. Alrighty. So, uh, what I did was I made a bunch of uh, advanced alloys. You know how to make this. Just um, compressing mixed metal, metal ingots in a compressor. But that's why it takes so long. So, I just um, I made a bunch of it already. I also made the advanced circuits because it's just a pain to make them. <laughs> so let's get right to it, shall we? Uh, so what we're going to need is... Is... Reactor chambers and nuclear reactors. So we're going to need... I think it's six... Reactor chambers... Plus two for the reactor. So we need eight of them. So let's start that first. Uh, so for that we need the advanced alloys, which I have already. Uh, we need machine blocks, which I haven't made yet, so... Uh, I hope that's enough. Let's take some of this out. I'm gonna need a lot of c copper as well. Radio. let's make some machine blocks. How many should we make? 39. Oh, yeah, that, oh that, that's enough. Plenty. Okay, cool. So, radio. Do I have more iron? Bit. Uh, but that'll be enough for now. Right, so, 
first of all, we're going to need to make integrated reactor plating. So now we need, we're need we going to just focus on the reactor chambers for now. So we need eight of these. So we need eight times three is 24 of these ones. And we need advanced alloy and copper for that. So we need 24 of them, I said. This... Oh, they don't stick. Oh, God. Okay, that's eight. Plus seven. It's 15, 16, 17. Okay, so that's 17. 17. Uh, 18. 19. 20. 21, 22, 23, 24. Right. Uh, what else we need? Uh, we also need the integrated heat disperser, which oh, we'll need another one of these. So we need another eight plates. Eight. Eight of them. So one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Okay, cool. So we did that. Uh, what else do we need for the heat disperser? Coolant cells, which also don't stack. Yay! <laughs> and copper, more more copper. So, um, oh no, I have enough copper. Cool. So I think what I'll do is take all this out because we don't need it for now. Um, put it in there. Uh, like that. Now we also don't need our wrench, and we also, at the moment, don't need our cables, and our MFSU, and our machine blocks either. So, yeah, we have a bit more space to play with, uh, I guess we don't need a stone brick either. So let's get some coolant cells out, that should be more than enough. Um, let's look at the recipe again, so two of these, alright. So that goes in the top, these go there, that goes there, copper goes there, yeah, there we go. Chuck some of these in there. So we need eight of these. Wow, okay. That's a bit insane. Two, three, four, five, six, one more coolant cell. Seven, eight. Nice. Right. So we did that. Uh, now what else do we need? Oh, the machine blocks, and then like that. Okay, cool. That's uh, that's good. I think we'll we'll make it. Uh, oh, of course, I completely forgot a recipe as I do. Uh, oh, I have to get all my. These reactor platings out of the um, damn it. Uh, let's put that in there. Put that in there. Put some of these in there. Oh, and our these as well. All right, cool. Uh. Uh. <laughs> ah, right. Yeah, of course. Advanced alloys. Alright, so it makes one, two, three, four, five. Did I not make enough? I don't think I made enough reactor platings. How did I mess that up? At five, six, seven, eight. Oh, okay, perfect. We got eight. Nice. Uh, so now we need to make our um, nuclear reactors. So the way we do that is generators. Oh, what? That's annoying. Um, actually, I might have some generators. Do I have any generators? Nope. Uh, there is a cheaty way to get him. <laughs> um, although, I think maybe not because I removed 
I don't have all these, um, yeah. Radio. I can try this. Oh no, that just drops machine blocks. I should have. Whatever. Whatever. We'll, we'll just make him. Uh, but let's make the other stuff first. Um, so we need to make only one nuclear chamber. So uh, nuclear reactor. Sorry. So um, we need to. I well, have everything except for the generator, actually. So let's make the generator, shall we? Um, we need cobble to make a furnace. No, that's stone. Uh, eight. Um, and we need a battery. Oh, God. Yes, yes, I'll fix this. I promise. <laughs> I promise. I swear it on my life. I was tin in there. On, I'll just make one. It's probably faster. Do I have any more tin? Yep. Some redstone. Uh, is that it? No, we need a copper cable as well. It's funny how you um, lose your mind for making the most simple tech -it items. Um, right. Furnace. There. That goes there. Machine block goes there. Generator. Two reactor chambers. Some advanced alloys. And some circuits. Very nice. Very, very cool. Alright, now, uh, what we need to do is make some heavy, heavy cables. Because we're going to do a little bit of a cheaty thing with the nuclear reactor. It's not really cheaty, but it's uh, it's using uh, goodness change. And we're going to do it using ice to cool the reactor. Which means we can get a insanely high um, energy output. So we're going to need the highest, highest, biggest cables. Which are these four times insulated HV cables. Um, so all we need for that is refined iron and rubber. Oh, rubber. Oh, I've got plenty of rubber. Huh. Huh. Didn't, didn't know I had that. That's, that's interesting. Anyways, uh, so we need more refined iron. Okie dokie. Uh, so let's see. We need to do this first. Uh, maybe make a stack. That, that will be plenty. And then we just combine this with more rubber. There we go. 64, no. There we go. Uh, so this cabling is... I don't know if the sound effect is all the same, but if it is, it's awesome. It is massive, as you can see. Um, see, it makes like a woolly sound when you break it. It's awesome. <laughs> it's amazing. Right. Oh, God. See, it's still there, Betsy. Bob is still there. Um, I know that the forest is still burning next to the village. <laughs> but they had it coming to them. They never even send a trade delegation here, you know. We can't have that type of uh, disobediency. Okay, let's go down to our power room, shall we? And, oh, we need to make, of course, the uranium. Uh-huh. Oops, forgot it. We'll do that as well. Um... I don't have any building blocks. Right. Actually, I might. Nope. <laughs> Give me a couple of these. Right. Uh, so, uh, let's um, put everything we need on a hotbar. Now, I haven't done this in a while, actually. Um, but the gist of it is where should we put it? Maybe here in the back. And then all the emphasis used can be there, sort of stacking on the wall like that. Uh, so yeah, let's... We've got enough height, so let's do it like this. So... Put the nuclear reactor down. So um, this is the chamber. That's where you put the uranium in and, and the coolant cells or ice, whatever you want to use. Uh, and then you can extend it by using these chambers like that. On all sides, including the top. 
and the bottom. And if you right click it, now you can see we have a massive chamber, which is good. Uh, right. So now we need to get this power. Hey, can't, why can't I? It's a bit weird. So that will pull it out. And we'll pull it along the wall here. Or oh, maybe not like that, actually. Like that. And then we're going to have to make a HV transformer to get this extreme voltage down to the normal voltage. Uh, well, not normal, but high voltage that we can use and store in the MFSUs. Um, so let's do that as well. There's always a party here, isn't it? Always a party. Radio. Um, now, how do we make that thing again? That's something you'll probably only make once. Ever. <laughs> HV transformer. Two of these cables, that's fine. An MV transformer, an NG crystal. Okay, well, let's make this one first. I have gold cables. I saw them. Yeah. Yeah, nice. Saving time. Oh, does it like that? Yeah, there we go. MV transformer. Right. So we got that. Uh, we need some normal electronic circuits, not these fancy ones. Uh, I'm guessing that I, I, I use them all to make the oh, to make these. Yeah. Oh no no no. There we go. Nice. Very nice. Uh, an energy crystal, which I'm sure I don't have any actually. Now, I think that was just redstone and diamond, wasn't it? Yeah. So, plenty of diamonds here. And we got redstone as well. So, this is uh, going well, actually. Uh, making progress. Making progress. Oh, oops. Make that thing. We needed that thing. We needed that thing. How did, how did, we, how did we do that? Oh. Uh, oh, of course. Okay, cool. So that goes there, that goes there, and then these cables that I have go there. Very cool. So now, what we can do is uh, get rid of all this stuff for now. I might, I'll clean it up later, <laughs> as always. Um, get our glass fiber and MFSUs out, and let's also take our wrench out again because, damn it. Because we might have to use that. Cool. Let's go back to our factory, shall we? Actually, let's sleep first. Wee. Wee. I'll just have a drink. Ah, refreshing. Good. Let the spiders control my door for a while. <laughs> I should really make an easy way to get into the basement. This is a bit annoying. I'd have to fly all the way or like this. Doesn't make much sense, does it? Not at all. Although I guess normally I would never come down here again. But still, there should be an easier way to get here. Right. Uh, so normally what you would do is you would put this in water to help cool it down. Um, but as we're going to use ice, um, we're not going to have to do that. Right, so this thing, if I just um, try and remember, it has... Oh, what, what the hell? Oh, it's here. Huh. Okay. <laughs> Let me out. Uh, if I remember correct... Really? That is annoying. Oh, it's not here? You know what? I'll make it a bit easier to get out if I can find... Oh, here. Okay, cool. All good. All good. Uh, let's take down that wall and replace that. Uh, after we do this. Yeah, so it's definitely connected to the right way. Make sure that the HV transformer has uh, all sides are the same except for one. Uh, which I can't see here, but uh, actually I can show you. 
So except for this side, which is the input, it's the opposite way as the MFS use because they have all the same size except one, which is the output. Uh, but this is the input, so that's good. There we go. So this is now converting the extreme voltage into high voltage. And high voltage is something that our um, MFS use can handle. Uh, so let's start making... Actually, I should check. If I do, if I do that, does it put the output at the top? Yes. Cool. Okay. So that's one. Uh, do we want to have cables in between? Yeah. Let's make it look more impressive. Because why not? You know. Ah, not the best tool to remove cables, but that's okay. Right, so we can start straight away here. So we're going to have MFSU cable. Oh. MFSU cable, MFSU cable, MFSU cable. Maybe cable, cable, MFSU cable. MFSU cable, 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 MFSU cable. Yeah, like that. that, that that's going to look great. Although it might not be enough MFSUs. I could connect them closer together, but I kind of like this. Um, <laughs> I kind of like the look of this. It's all about the look of things, you know. So that's all That's all everything is. Now, I wonder how far we have to go. Okay. Not, not too far. So this will power the entire factory, really. Um, I might make some solid panels as well just in case I'm lazy and I don't renew the, the power but really this will be the main power source and it will be able to do that right here I'll do let's uh, put the um, shoes down uh, and yes these were a pain to make I spent probably about three hours just making MF shoes that's how painful it was <laughs> it's so boring and you have to make Damn it! Everything handmade as well. Uh, yeah, it's just, ugh. especially the rubber. That's always the worst part, to be honest. Right. Uh, let's put that down. I actually have to dig in a bit. Bottom. Bottom. So nice. I think that that'll look cool, to be honest. Uh, and then we go up again. There. There, there. Oh, damn it. <laughs> and there. Give me my. Yeah, thanks. Thank you very much. So, same here. I'll put down this time. That. I said down, but that's. I guess I'll accept that. There you go. Might as well do that for all of them, by the way. Just go plonk, plonk, plonk. I mean, this will hold. I'm not going to use all 60, obviously, but. Which is a bit annoying because I spent so much time, so. <laughs> I might figure out a way to use all 60 of them. Because <laughs> uh, I don't want to have to waste all my time that I did making this. Anyway, so these all have to go up, 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 up. And these have to go up. On that. Yep. So, yeah, this will come down, down, down. Oh, God, that's annoying. Um, down, 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 down. And then we make some holes in the floor everywhere. Can I reach that? Oh yeah. I can hear spiders and I don't like it. <laughs> Not a big fan to be honest. Right. So that is our mega power ball of MFSUs. I mean if if that gets full and I don't have enough power in some way, I don't know how, but some way, um I'll quit. I've said it, I'll quit. Uh anyway, so let's see is Four in a row, so I can I can plant five more rows. That's what I could do. 
is um let's see one two three wait oh yeah and one there absolutely wow that is pretty cool oh no no <laughs> no Oh god no! Well, it's not too bad. I'll, I'll remake them. That's not a problem. Uh, anyways, uh, so these go up. So this will have to go down. Now there's gonna be, let's see, that goes up. This goes down. This goes up. So it comes from here. This goes down, up, and this comes from there. So the HV voltage generator needs to be maybe. I don't know, maybe there. Put the input there. Um, oh, I didn't take my cables either. Anyways, the um, nuclear reactor will be here, which I can't do at the moment, of course. Uh, this will be connected on that, into it, eventually. And this top will go like that, into the first MFSU, and then it disconnects like that. Like where we did with the others. Let's do that a bit quickly. I mean, yeah, I mean, seriously, if this does not create an or hold or store enough power for it, well, it doesn't really matter what you want to do, anything you want to do. <laughs> uh, right, so let's uh, punch a hole here. That will have to go down. Now, why is this red? What are you? Transformer. What? Did I place the wrong one? Oh god, thank f god I saw that. Because that would have blown up every single machine here, I think. <laughs> Whoopsie. That's better. Get in there. So that has to point downwards. That has to point downwards. And that one has to point downwards. Down. Down. Down, 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 and this one the last. Uh, yeah, all good. So these all have to go up. No, wait, damn it. Up, up, up. Voilà. That's it. So we're done. Uh, that's pretty much it. So, that's it for this episode. Uh, next episode, we'll actually turn it on. We'll start making the um, uranium. Uh, and I'll show you the ingenious cooling method I saw somewhere else on YouTube. I can't even remember where. I was just, uh, it was a couple of weeks ago that I saw it. So we're going to try it. Uh, see if that works. If it doesn't work, uh, well, there's not going to be anything left of my whole factory. Um, <laughs> so, that's going to be fun, you know. Uh, I guess I could put reinforced glass around the factory to be safe, but where's the fun in that? It's kind of fun when stuff explodes, you know. So, um, yeah, we'll do that next time. Thanks for watching again, guys. Um, I'll see you in the next episode where we turn this bad boy on and see how much power we can store. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys.